What is going on, YouTubers? FedEx finally brought me my PS5. So I'm super excited. I pre-ordered this day one from Walmart. I was one day delayed and I called them and got $25 refund, but here it is. Oh, I still remember the PS4, the PS3. I waited outside of Walmart for five days to get the PlayStation 3, believe it or not. Nowadays, you just pre-order it online, but back then, they did not have that. Alrighty, so let's remove this. So this actually comes out. So there's the main box. Here it is, it has a decent weight to it, maybe 15 pounds. Unfortunately, I don't have any games right now. Uh, Amazon messed up on delivering my Miles Morales, and I'm not getting it until tomorrow, so I'm just gonna check out some 4K movies on this. Alrighty. So we got the new controller here, which feels and looks fantastic. Lightweight but not too light that it feels like you're holding nothing. Here's the power cord. Uh, charging cable for your controller. Quick start, quick start guide, safety guide. And then what we have here, Not sure what this is, but <clears throat> we will check it out. And a cable to plug it into your TV. Although I don't think this is the HDMI 2.1, if I was to guess. High speed HDMI. I will use the ones I bought because I bought HDMI 2.1 to ensure I get 4K at 120 frames. So when I'm gaming, there is just zero lag. Now let's check out this PlayStation 5. And here she is. Boom. Huge fan in the back. Now I'm going to assume this is how you stand it upright, if I was to guess. Now the game's insert right here, so it's probably going to be like this, if I was to guess. Maybe put the controller there. This is me guessing. But I'll have to figure it out. But here it is. PlayStation 5. In all its glory. So you can just see everything you get. This console's going for one to $2,000 on eBay. I got mine at $4.99. And I got $25 off actually, which covered tax really. But we're gonna plug it into this LG CX 77 inch OLED TV and see how good looking this looks. We're gonna check out some 4K movies and some PlayStation games that are supposed to be upgraded to the PlayStation 5. So at least we can see what those look like. So let's get to that. Before we do dive in, this is a case that you're supposed to attach the console to like so. So you remove this little screw from the bottom of this and remove this little cap that was inside there. And we're basically just gonna screw this bad boy in. Alrighty, now here's the PlayStation all set up with its little stand, help it stand up. And here is the controller. As you can see, it looks beautiful, feels great. There's the PlayStation. This is meant to stand up. Uh, that's how they prefer it, but you can do it uh, laying the other way as well. They do include the stand, so you can do it that way. But here it is. Uh, on the back, you have two USBs, Ethernet, HDMI, and the power cord. And then, obviously, on the this side, another USB and charging cable, and the discs will be inserted via this slot right here. So we're gonna go ahead and set this up. I actually don't have any space in front of my TV, so it'll be displayed behind it, but I'll make sure I can easily reach the disc area, the charging cable, and so forth. 
Alrighty, so we got it all connected. And it wants us to connect the controller first. Continue with the screen reader turned on. Continue. Buzzer. Screen reader. No. Alrighty, folks, I am finally in. I transferred some content from my old PlayStation 4 over there. Uh, but here we are. I'm finally at the main screen of the PlayStation 5. Now, this does come with a free game, Astro Playroom. Uh, so we can definitely try that out and see how that is. Controller's vibrating the entire time. Whoa, that feels much different than PS4. Interesting, that's a built-in microphone. Hello? This is quite a cool controller, no doubt. There's definitely some differences. I'm digging this. You're collecting PlayStation coins if you can't tell. Folks, that is this game so far. Pretty fun, actually. Uh, kind of digging this. So I'm going to play this for a little bit and then give you some final thoughts on this. But pretty great intro, and I'm glad they actually included a, you know some sort of free game on this. Very, very cool. You know, showing off the old consoles and everything. Very nostalgic, no doubt. Because I've been a huge gamer my whole life. So very, very cool. Alrighty, so I'm just gonna show you some of the menus and things that this thing can do. So here in media, you have all the different apps that you wanna download. By the way, I just tried Peacock, tons of free cool movies. Uh, and then you can go to games, and of course you have Marvel Avengers, it just downloaded for me. It's downloading all my games. Very simple menu, you just got games and then media. So, but we'll be playing Miles Morales tomorrow, uh, as well as I got Demon's Souls, so. Definitely looking forward to all that. Anyways, folks, the PS5 is absolutely amazing. I'm super stoked to have this. I uh, can't wait to play Miles Morales, Demon's Souls. Uh, you know, I'm a huge gamer. So thank you all for watching this video. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Got some great content coming shortly. Like, comment, subscribe. Have a great day.